welcome you all here uh, to our marble factory. Uh, my name is Ambrose Joyce and this marble of course is our local marble, the Connemara marble and it's quarried 40 miles from here near Clifton in Connemara. Now in Ireland the green marble is only found in this region so Connemara is quite famous for its marble quarries. That quarry was opened commercially in 1822 and marble from the quarry has been exported all over the world where you will see it in cathedrals and public buildings. Now this is the light green marble, this is the surface of the light green marble as it is before polishing, sawn face of the marble and the finished product after polishing. It's far brighter as you may see after the polishing process. This piece of marble we call is the Irish jade variety of the marble. <coughs> the jade marble is in very short supply so it's only used for the manufacturing of small jewellery stones, for example uh, the leaves of the shamrocks. Now it was copper in the ground, copper oxides, which gave the marble its green colour. So copper made the marble green. It's among the oldest marbles in the world from the pre-Cambrian time. So that makes it about 600 million years old. Now we can also cut marble into very thin slices. And here again an example of the sepia. And if a light is put behind a thin piece of marble, it becomes translucent. Marble filters the UV light. The Rare Book Library of Yale University in Connecticut in the USA has Vermont marble windows and the Vermont marble windows uh, filter the UV light. Now the black marble was mud on the bed of the bay and became compressed 350 million years ago. In the south of Ireland in County Cork, Middleton County Cork, we once had a very beautiful red marble quarry. Now, this quarry is closed about 50 years but I'd like to show it to you because you would see it in our cathedrals and public buildings as you travel throughout Ireland. Iron ox sides in the ground during the marble's formation gave it its beautiful red colour. It's the Middleton Red, the Irish Rose Marble from the south of Ireland in County Cork. And finally in Achill Island in County Mayo we have a small deposit of amethyst, Irish amethyst from Achill Island. Amethyst in the ground comes in a geode formation, a hollow stone like an egg. And it's the outside of the geode like a common country rock broken open to find the crystals inside. It's semi-precious and it's also the birthstone for the month of February. <laughs> <laughs>